Hi friends, my name is AJ and welcome back to my channel. Today, I really wanted to do something that was a little bit less stressful and time consuming. Although I do think this is going to be a little time consuming, just not in the way that you think. Today, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be doing um, an embroidery hoop with a Disney character. I thought I'd just sit here and do some embroidering. I, I'm not the best at embroidering, but I'm not bad at it either. This is gonna be just like a really super chill video. I have some nice hot tea here. I'm just kidding, it's Arizona iced tea. I don't, I don't have any hot tea right now. I made my little Guinevere into a place to store all my embroidery thread. And I don't know, I thought I'd just hot chat and have a good time. Um, so today we're going to embroider Marie. She's one of my friend's favorite Disney characters. And then I'll give it to her and hopefully she likes it. But first, I have to make her. I uh, traced her out from a picture I found on Google. And I'm not really going to be following any particular like pattern or anything. I'm just, I'm just gonna kind of go for it. I also don't know that many different ways to embroider other than the up, down, up, down. So we'll see how this goes. I, <laughs> I hope it turns out well. So I have this white and then I have a pink for the bow and then I have some blue for her eyes, very pastel colors. And I also have black. I have lots of black. And then I have some needles. Loud. I don't think I have the right needles for this. Probably not. Got this itty bitty baby needle that's already bent. I'm gonna tip this down because it wobbles a lot. Sorry, Guinevere. All right, so we're gonna start with the black one. Oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I took too much out, uh-oh. Uh-oh, I lost the, I lost the end. Oh, it's right there, wait, oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I usually embroider and start a new show at the same time, but because I'm going to be recording, I feel like that would be very distracting, so I'm not going to do that. So I'm re-watching you. I have some complicated emotions about you, but I do like it. Oh, the thread's too big for this kind of needle. Oh no. Oh. I'm ruining it, I'm ruining it, I'm ruining it. Okay, I need a bigger needle. So this one is for quilting. And my friend Emily will probably murder me if she ever sees this, but I am gonna use it. Oh no. Ugh, I just, I just ruined that. So I'm just going to outline Marie now. There we go. And we have lift off. I hope she likes it. And if she doesn't, then I'll keep it. And I'll hang it. Right, right there. You can't see that, it's out of frame. Oh, I hate when this happens. I hate when this happens when your excess gets like caught. Oh no, I like really screwed that up. Normally I just leave it, but now I don't wanna look stupid in front of Oh, I got it out. Yes. AJ1, embroidering zero. See, I don't know if you guys like want me to talk through this entire thing. I don't really have much to say. Don't do that, Daphne, don't do it, don't do it. Okay, I guess update with being furloughed. Um, I haven't been called back yet. Oh, I made a tingling mess. I don't expect to be called back uh, for the opening just because it's all based on seniority and I like barely made the cutting board last time. So I don't think I'll be coming back anytime soon. I would like it if I did. I would like it very much if I did, but it just doesn't seem 
like that's gonna happen, which is okay. I just went to that Stranger Things drive through and I'm probably gonna go again to take my brother, but it was a lot of fun going to the drive through I got scared once because some evil Russian decided to bang on my window, scaring the bejesus out of me, whatever. I thought it'd be a lot scarier. I was like really nervous about going because I am a baby, but I didn't get as scared as I thought I would, so. I think this segment is gonna be fun because I get to make these things for my friends and then my friends watching will have to guess who's getting an embroidery hoop this week and I think that'd be fun. I don't think it'd be a lot of fun for people who don't know my friends. So maybe eventually I can branch out to people who are like interested in like actually having it. I don't know who would really want like a mediocre embroidery hoop, but like if someone wants one and is willing to share their address with me, I'll, I'll make you one fam and I'll send it to you free of charge. DM me on Instagram, I want one. And then tell me like a character from Disney, has to be Disney. And um, I'll make you one and then I'll send it to you. So I've been working on this for about an hour and this is how far I've gotten. I always go into this being like, oh, I will do it real quick and then it always takes so much time. Oh, all of this hair just... It just went... That's cute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look at that mess. Ooh. It's okay. You know like how some people do like, Oh, get ready with me. And they put on their makeup for the day. I feel like I can't do stuff like that because I don't usually wear a lot of makeup. And I don't do like fun looks or anything ever. I was going to film a makeup video for you guys and I was gonna like try some Disney inspired makeup stuff. And then I got really scared cause like, I don't know. I don't know anything about makeup at all. I thought embroidering would be more fun because I am an old, old woman who likes to embroider in her free time. I'll come back when I have finished outlining the entire body. How about that? I don't know how many times the angle has moved just because I've been kicking it and I've been sat here for hours. Um, my hair's up now because I couldn't handle it being on the side and, and this falling and so this is the outline I think it looks really cute I noticed that when I outline things they look really cute and then when I fill them in that's when things start getting a little wonky so we're gonna hope for the best with me on that yes I do have scissors but I refuse to get up and get them so now we're gonna fill in with white I probably should have gotten more white this might be mm. It might be okay. We'll find out, won't we? Oh, I got all my threads mixed together. Oh no! Ah! Uh, oh god! Oh no! Come on! There we go. Oh, this guy's a lot thicker than the last stuff I was using. Ruh -roh. Not a good sign on my part. When is it ever a good sign for me? I'm getting a lot of resistance from this thing. It, uh, I made it too long and it's too thick and I don't know what to do. This is how far I've gotten. I'm convinced that this video is just gonna be my slow descent into madness. So what I'm going to do for the ruffles like right here is I'm going to attempt a chain stitch. I've never done one before, so we're gonna see how this goes. Uh, my phone ran out of storage there for a minute, so I had to take a break. 
and upload the other footage so I have room for the new stuff. This is what I have so far. I don't know if I'm gonna do like a complete thing of chain knots or if I'm going to just do simple stitching in the middle. I haven't gotten that far yet, but we'll see. <laughs> it's going okay. The chains are definitely like different sizes, but I'm on the last episode of you. And I'm gonna watch it. I've already seen it, so I know what's gonna happen, but I'm just gonna watch it. So I just finished the ruffles and I think it looks pretty cute. I, I ended up going with ruffles just like in the full patch of fur. And I think it turned out rather nice. I'm gonna do the rest of the body, then I'll come back. I've, I've just finished you. And so now I guess I'll just be watching old episodes of Gilmore Girls. Also, I, I finally got scissors. Yeah, M making, making headway, making smart decisions now. All right, my fingers hurt. This is the body. I think it's coming out really cute. I'm actually really proud of this. Um, I have to do the face next, but it's actually like, I'm, I'm doing a pretty good job. I, <laughs> not to toot my own horn or anything, but I think it's really cute. The face is going to be the hard part. I think I'm going to start with the eyes, which I'm going to use this, this blue color. I'm going to keep watching Gilmore Girls. I'm going to do the pupils and then I'm going to do the color. And I'll see how that looks, and if it looks scary, then I will outline the eyeball with black. Got some pupils going on there. I think I'm gonna need a lot of blue. Maybe like... Are you even scissors if you don't cut? You know, this thread is really just trying my patience. I'm going crazy, I'm going crazy, I'm going crazy. So, this is what I have so far. So for the nose, I decided to do a split stitch because I thought it would contrast from the rest of the head. I'm starting to get very tired. I've been doing this for hours and I wanna stop, but I need to finish this. I'm going insane. Um. So this is how much white I have left and this is how much I still need to do. I'm worried I'm not gonna have enough white. I might, I might, uh, I don't know. The eyes also look a little creepy. So I think I'm gonna try and save it. I think I'm gonna try to save it with black. Overall though, not bad. I've been doing this for a really long time and I'm really tired. Uh, I don't know why I decided to do this. It is currently 2 a.m. I've been up doing this literally all day and I'm, and I'm almost, I'm almost done. I'm almost done. I'd show you, but then you pretty much know what it looks like already. And I don't want to, I don't want I want to be a special reveal. So I just need to finish up the bows really quick. And then once I'm done with that, then I will show you what I finally got. Th this isn't turning out exactly like how I wanted it to, but it, good enough and I think it's kind of cute but doesn't matter I made it and it took hours and I hope my friend likes it so I, I'm gonna finish really quick so I don't go insane and and then I'll show you how it turned out it is currently 2 30 in the morning and I am finally done my hands hurt I've watched more Gilmore Girls than I intended to today, and I have slowly become insane. But it is finally done. And here is the final product. The eyes are a little wonky, I, I can admit that. I redid them like twice, and it got to the point where I got too tired to even try. So this is, <laughs> this is what it is. I'll do a little close up. I think it's cute. It's it's special. And I am proud of it. That's gonna be it for today's video. I'm really, really tired. 
and I hope you enjoyed watching me go insane. Maybe I'll do this some other time and I will try something easier because that took forever. If you did like this video, make sure to like and subscribe and that's all I have for you today. So thanks for hanging out with me. Bye. Oh, that was rude. I keep getting stuck. I keep getting the the. the...